Today on World Wednesdays, we're on a mission. And this is a joint project that I'm talking about between the drainage division and the Barbados Water Authority as we try to find some answers to two problems that we've been facing here in Barbados. To tell me a bit more about this initiative and what you can expect from it, we have Dr. John Mwanza. He's a technical advisor to the Barbados Water Authority. Dr. Mwanza, uh, tell us a bit about this joint effort as we try to solve some of the drainage issues and catch some water for our aquifers at the same time. Essentially, the, the project involves looking at where we could catch some of that water that runs through the gullies, for example, uh, or surface runoff, uh, for, to achieve two purposes. One, flood control, and two, groundwater recharge. Mm. For groundwater recharge to be effective, those check dams or structures that we build have to be upstream of where our existing uh, abstraction wells are. And if you, if you build your check dams lower down, then what that does the, is basically solve two purposes. One, it contributes to flood, flood control, but it also, if that water is induced to go into the ground, it will push back when it gets towards the sea and stop the seawater from coming in. So that is part of how you manage seawater intrusion that would come inland and affect our water supply. So you're basically looking at the facilities that work has started on. For example, there is work that was done at the confluence of the Pori Spring Gully and the Danscombe Gully, which then joins into one that comes down by Port Vale Sugar Factory. Inland, there is a depression that has been created by quarrying the, the, the rock in that area that was done by C.O. Williams. So what you have is a depression. So instead of the water running straight past that junction, it will get detained and will slow down the process of going downstream. But mm. while it is in that pond, it will also contribute to groundwater recharge. We also looked at... Uh, the Sunset Crest uh, check dam which has been done. That's where we are right now. That's where we are now. That will essentially contribute more to ground to flood control as well as salt water intrusion. So what we are looking at is the number of gullies to reduce the amount of water that will get to the coast. We, to do, when you do that, you keep that water inland and it will contribute to groundwater recharge and it also helps you with flood control. I know it might be too early to talk about how much water we can possibly capture through this project. Will there be, will be, will there be an analysis on that? What we have to do when, uh, on these check dams where we are constructing them is also ch set up monitoring points mm -hmm. so that you could measure how much water actually came through the gully. Right. At this point, we, 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 we haven't set that up. We had set up one, oh, MTW had set up one at Sela Gully. And what they have been able to observe is that the water does not top the check dam, which means most of that water which, have, which would have come from upstream is being held and controlled inland. And so the, the potential for downstream uh, flooding is minimized. And we're getting extra water too? We're getting extra water too. Mm. How so it's a win-win situation. Uh, this sounds like really good news and of course we'll keep you updated yeah. right here on Water Wednesdays. And you saw the minister taking the tour with us, the new minister of transport, works and water, uh, Ian Gooding Edgel. He will be spending some time with us on Water Wednesdays very soon as well. And you will hear from him about his plans to improve our water situation here and right across the island. And also taking the tour, minister in the Ministry of Water Resources, Charles Griffith. Of course, all of this happening right here, you can check us out on Facebook and Instagram. And also, you can go to our website, www.barbadiswaterauthority.com. And then you can go to YouTube as well. You can definitely find us there. 